Big news coming out of Philly. The Eagles have agreed to trade Carson Wentz to the Colts for a third-round pick in this year's draft and a conditional second-rounder in next year's draft that could turn into a first-round pick. NFL Network's Mike Garofolo reports the conditional pick will become a first-round selection if Wentz plays 75% of the Colts' offensive snaps or 70% of the snaps and the team makes the playoffs. Wentz will be reunited with Frank Reich, who is Wentz's offensive coordinator for the first two years of his career. In other news, the NFL has sent a memo to team saying the salary cap floor has been increased from $175 million to $180 million after talks with the NFLPA. That also according to Garofolo. The Falcons have parted ways with safety Ricardo Allen, and the Raiders have re-signed defensive lineman David Irving. This has been NFL Network Now on the Westwood One Radio Network. Maybe you've heard about MediShare and you know what it is. It's the affordable alternative to health insurance. But you've wondered, can I really save a significant amount of money on my monthly health care bills? And the answer is an emphatic, yes, you can. You can save a lot of money, whether it's just for you or for an entire family. MediShare has an option for you. In fact, the typical family saves $500 a month switching to MediShare. And it really is the gold standard when it comes to healthcare sharing. You get free telehealth services. You get a huge network of doctors. You get great customer support. And you get the sense of security that comes from being a part of 400,000 people who share not just each other's medical bills, but purpose too. MediShare is a community of Christians who pull together and pray for each other, which is very refreshing right now. If you want more info, it's so simple. You can get a price within two minutes. Call 844-91-BIBLE. That's 844-91-BIBLE. 844-91-BIBLE. We are the Imperial Valleys. AM 1230 KXO. El Centro, California. Ah, yes. It's a Friday. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Whoopee, Friday. Doesn't mean a whole lot anymore. Yeah, good morning, Gene. Good morning. Ah, another beautiful day. Another uh, bright and uh, nippy little snap in the air. Yes. Oh, well. Anyway, uh, we've got a look at world in California news, local news, sports, financial news, weather. Um, we'll go in-depth with the weather and a few other things. Coming up at about 8.30, I'll be visiting with uh, Jeanette Angulo, the Imperial mm -hmm. County Public Health Department director. And uh, we'll get um, an update on the COVID-19 situation. And, uh, well... Uh, <laughs> I'm just kind of chuckling. Okay, waiting for your first shot, right? Yeah, now officials in Washington are saying, uh, because of the variations and the variants and the mutations, you're probably going to need a third shot. So, <laughs> let's get the first one, okay? Hmm. Hmm. Mm. Oh, well. And they knew it would mutate, so... Well, I mean, that's nothing new. No. The flu is not at all mutated forever. So. Yes. Oh, well. Anyway, you got big plans for the weekend? Uh, same as last week and the week before. <laughs> <laughs> and the last 52 weekends, yeah. right? Yeah. Pretty much. Pretty much the same. Yes. Oh, yeah, I... I'm debating whether I really want to start working on my taxes because... But if I do, I'm going to have to figure out where I hid the shoeboxes full of receipts. Mm. That is always uh, a problem. Yeah, I never mm. put them in the same place. And, uh, you know, with Louie around the house, Louie, for some reason, loves to chew up paper. Mm. I would have liked to have had him around when I was in school. Yeah, for your homework. Yeah. You would have taken care of that in a heartbeat. Yeah, Louie, here's an algebra paper. Can you chew it up? Chew it up. Yeah, Brother Fitz will never know. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, well. Anyway, you ready for birthdays? Birthdays, we've got some. Big Shot and uh, the real guys. Okay. Actor Carlin Glenn is 81. Smokey Robinson is 81. No word on the miracles. Mel Christie is 78. I can't get that high. Uh, actor Michael Nader is 76. 
Tommy Iommi plays guitar for Black Sabbath, 73. Actor Stephen Nichols, 70. Actor Jeff Daniels is 66. Actor Leslie David Baker, 63. Actor Jessica Tuck is 58. Actor Justine Bateman, 55. Actor Benicio del Toro is 54. Actor Bellamy Young, 51. Daniel Adair plays drums for Nickelback used to be with Three Doors Down, is 46. Uh, singer, actor Haley Duff is 36. Actor Victoria Justice, 28. Actor David Mazos is 20. Actor Millie Bobby Brown is 17. Local birthdays coming up. Become a hunger warrior. Donate to the Imperial Valley Food Bank. The need for the IV Food Bank's backpack program has more than doubled during the pandemic. Through this program, schools distribute backpacks with needed items to make sure no kid or family goes hungry during the weekend when no school food service is available. It's tough enough being a kid. They don't need to have hunger be an issue. The Imperial Valley Food Bank needs your help. Become a hunger warrior. We have our KXO birthdays. Happy birthday, Jay Silva, Mayella Rees, Judy Brewer, Jerry Whitman, Irene Solario, Connie English, Buck Benson, Robert Phillips, Julian Hernandez, Aida Camuso, Leticia Garcia, Nina Hernandez, Cesar Moore, Vivian Jaramillo, Nancy Dye, Candy Sanchez, Robert Ignite, Nora Sanchez, Julian Barbosa, Beatriz Renteria, and happy birthday, Jack Kirby. Jack is 90-11. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, Jack <laughs> ran out of fingers and toes to uh, count his birthdays yeah. a couple of years ago. Uh, you gave him something to uh, think about right now. Yeah. I believe he did teach uh, Tom and Jerry, his Clydesdale team, how to count. Yeah. Remember how Roy Rogers had trigger count? Yeah. 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 At Jack's age, it would have taken Tom and Jerry, you know, all four feet a long of each time. horse. Yeah, a long time. <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, happy birthday, Jack. Yeah, now you're supposed to remember his birthday. You remember. Yeah, right? it's not today. Yeah. No. But we wanted to make sure we, we got it in there. Yeah. So, uh Anyway, um, and Jack, I sure do miss the tapioca pudding at the Cameo Buffet, right? <laughs> yeah, tapioca. Forgot okay. all about that. Yes. Ah, we've got news and stuff. Are you ready for that? We do. We got news. The okay. biometric comparison technology has arrived at the yeah. crossing. We'll talk about that. Stuff from the future is already here. Yes, it is. Stuff. Okay. We've got a look at World in California news headlines brought to you this morning by Lock Air Conditioning. They are your year-round comfort specialist. Talk to Lock Air Conditioning about a preseason air conditioner checkup. CBS News Brief. The heat's back on in Texas, but food supplies are dwindling, and Joel Burns in Dallas is among almost half of state residents without potable water. We walked in, and about two-thirds of the ceiling was collapsed. There was sheetrock all over the floor, and water was just gushing in. Federal Judge Esther Salas, whose son was killed in their New Jersey home, tells CBS is 60 Minutes. The FBI discovered evidence the gunman was also targeting a Supreme Court. The most troubling thing they found was a manila folder with a workup on Justice Sonia Sotomayor. After a one-year trial period, Buckingham Palace says Prince Harry and his wife Meghan have decided not to return to royal duties. The BBC's Johnny Diamond. The couple's spokesman replied that Harry and Meghan remain committed to duty and service. We can all live a life of service. The statement says service is universal. They live in California now. CBS News Brief.
I'm Deborah Rodriguez. Whatever the weather brings this winter, you can rely on a York Affinity Premium System to keep your home warm and comfortable. You'll get maximum efficiency thanks to advanced technology and helping to significantly reduce your energy bills. Plus, you can stay connected via our Wi-Fi enabled touchscreen thermostat. Every York unit is designed, engineered, and assembled in the United States and backed by industry leading warranties. Affordable financing options are available. Call Lock Air Conditioning in your local York dealer at 760-353-4501. That's 353-4501 to schedule a free evaluation of your system. York, install confidence. Contractor's license 696-216. California headline news cheers in Pasadena and across the country Thursday as the Mars rover Perseverance landed on the surface of the red planet set to search for signs of life. At a post-landing briefing at the Jet Propulsion Lab in Pasadena, NASA Administrator Steve Jerzyk said... About an hour after landing, I got a phone call from the President of the United States, and uh, and he, his first words were, congratulations, man. And I knew it was him. A rubber designed and piloted at the JPL. Thousands of COVID vaccine appointments postponed in Los Angeles with the weather across the country delaying shipments of the needed doses. And if you're waiting on your second dose at one of our sites, you'll still get it within that time period recommended by the CDC. And you'll receive a text and an email notification with an auto-scheduled appointment. Mayor Eric Garcetti, apparently dangerous travel conditions in Tennessee and Kentucky forced flights with the doses on board to stay grounded. 5,500 new COVID cases, the state reporting Thursday, marking a 2% increase from the day before. Jeff Scott, California News. World in California News headlines brought to you this morning by Lock Air Conditioning, your year-round comfort specialist. Get ready. Summer will be here before you know it. Get that preseason air conditioner checkup now. Hey, I'm Andy. If you don't know me, it's probably because I'm not famous. But I did start a men's grooming company called Harry's. The idea for Harry's came out of a frustrating experience I had buying razor blades. Brands were overpriced, overdesigned, and out of touch. At Harry's, our approach is simple. Here's our secret. We make sharp, durable blades and sell them at honest prices for as low as $2 each. We care about quality so much that we do some crazy things, like buy a world-class German blade factory. Obsessing over every detail means we're confident in offering a 100% quality guarantee. Millions of guys have already made the switch to Harry's, so thank you if you're one of them. And if you're not, we hope you give us a try with this special offer. A Harry starter set with a five-blade razor, weighted handle, shave gel, and a travel cover. All for just three bucks, plus free shipping. Just go to harrys.com and enter 6677 at checkout. That's harrys.com, code 6677. Enjoy. And it's page one of the local news. Page one of service of Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers. They have two locations in the valley on Imperial Avenue next to Food for Less in El Centro and in the Brawley Auto Center, Highway 86 and Julia Drive. Taking a look at the latest in local news for a Friday morning, the COVID-19 update. The figures are in. George Gale has the story. The numbers were released by the Public Health Department. According to the update, active cases of the virus in Imperial County are at 338. That's 22 less than what was reported on Wednesday. There are currently 30 COVID-19 patients hospitalized in Imperial County. That's two more than what was reported previously. There are two ICU beds available in the Imperial County. New cases per day uh, per 100,000 population is at 18.11. That's down from 18.71 reported Wednesday. Positivity rate has gone way down to 10.28 percent. That's down from 18.03 percent reported on Wednesday. Death toll attributed to COVID-19 remains at 584. For KXO Local News, I'm George Gale. A special meeting of the IID Board of Directors is uh, coming up on Tuesday, February the 23rd. The special meeting will be on the 2021 Annual Strategic Plan. That concludes this edition of Local News. No. No, we'll be back with uh, the second half of page we, one. We will be back. Okay. Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers in Brawley and El Centro suggest the works. The works, including... 
tire rotation and pressure check, brake inspection, fluid top-off, battery test, filter check, belts and hoses check, and synthetic blend oil change with up to six quarts of Motorcraft oil plus oil filter. You can't beat the works. Quick Lane services all makes and all models, and you never need an appointment. Quick Lane in Raleigh and El Centro, ready to serve. Well, scams continue to be in the news, and another one with a warning. Here's more in the story. The IID has issued another public alert. Imperial Irrigation District says scammers are posing as utility representatives and contacting customers over the phone and through email. They are demanding immediate payment or financial information, threatening to disconnect customers' electric services. They say the, these uh, phone calls and emails are not coming from the IID. Danny Hurtado Jr., IID Customer Call Center Supervisor, says they encourage everyone to be aware that this activity is going on and to be cautious, especially during these challenging times. If you receive a scam call, hang up and call the IID. For KXL Local News, I'm George Gale. Senator Ben Hueso has announced that he has selected Calexico resident Raldolfo or Rudy Villalobos as the 2020 Veteran of the Year for the 40th Senate District. Rudy is not a highly decorated veteran, so stated he is a role model for all who meet him and has contributed immensely to the prosperity of our nation through both his military and civilian service. Rudy served in the U.S. Air Force during World War II and was well decorated for his uh, service. In, he uh, served in the 8th uh, Air Force 96 Bomb Group as a radio operator gunner on a B-17 Flying Fortress. Rudy flew 32 missions during his career, 17 over France, 14 over Germany, one over the Czechoslovakia Republic. He was honorably discharged on December 7th of 1945. After the war, Rudy worked for the U.S. Department of Labor in Mexico and then the U.S. Justice Department as an immigration supervisor. He retired after 34 years in government service. In 2015, the Consul General of France presented Rudy with the National Order of uh, the Legion of Honor in the rank of Chevalier uh, for his uh, participation in the liberation of France during World War II. Rudy is 97 years old and lives in Calexico with his wife of 69 years. They have nine children, 29 grandchildren, and six great-grandchildren. Congratulations, Rudy. That concludes this edition of Local News. Page 2 coming up. Page 1 of the Local News, the service of Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers in Brawley and El Centro. Quick Lane, they've got the best price on tires guaranteed. Talk to your Quick Lane service advisor. San Diego, looking for a great deal on a new truck or SUV? Well, the President's Day Sellathon is on at your San Diego County Ford dealers. Come get the first big offers of the year on SUVs and trucks across the Ford lineup. Big deals on Ford Explorer, the number one selling SUV in the U.S. for the last 30 years? They're on. Deals on Ford trucks, the best selling truck brand in California? They're on too. A deal on almost every vehicle in the Ford lineup? It's all on. But don't take my word for it. Visit BuyFordNow.com to see the deals for yourself. That's BuyFordNow.com. SUV claim based on total cumulative OEM reported U.S. sales for all SUVs from calendar year 1990 through calendar year 2019. Truck claim based on IHS market total U.S. new vehicle registrations for the Ford Custom Truck Vehicle Type CYTD, August 2020. The President's Day sell -thon is on. So get on the road to your San Diego County Ford dealers and get these deals before they're gone. <laughs> It's page two of the local news and in-depth weather, all brought to you by David H. West Insurance Services. You can see David, you can see Jose, you can get answers to your questions about life insurance, health insurance, or retirement planning. Continuing with more local news, the U.S. Uh, Customs uh, Border Protection technology has arrived. The uh, Customs say the new system is at the pedestrian crossing in Calexico. Simplified arrival is an enhanced 
international arrival process that uses facial biometrics uh, to automate the manual document checks that are required for admission into the United States. According to CBP, the process provides travelers with a secure, touchless travel experience while meeting the mandates to biometrically record the entry and exit of non-U.S. citizens. The system uses the biometric facial comparison process at a time and place where travelers are already required to be verified uh, their uh, identity. When a traveler arrives at the pedestrian lanes or undergoes uh, I-94 uh, processing at Calexico, they will pause for a photo at the primary inspection point. A CBP officer will review and query the travel document, which will retrieve the traveler's passport or visa photo from the database. Photos will be compared for identity. The process takes only a few seconds. Well, it's hard to believe, but uh, trouble again with the bridge at Forrester. George Gale has the story. It is between Imler and Keystone Roads. Wednesday, a vehicle traveling on Forrester collided with the newly constructed bridge. There were no injuries as a result of that. Coll County Public Works closed a portion of Forrester Road in order to uh, repair the guardrail on the bridge and to inspect the bridge for any structural damage. Closure is in effect until further notice. For KXO Local News, I'm George Gale. The Heffernan Memorial Healthcare District uh, Board of Directors approved three health and wellness programs to help mitigate some of the health problems caused by COVID-19 in Calexico. As part of the district request for proposal, our RFP, six applicants uh, related to health and wellness, the applicants that qualified for their grants, grants are Vaux Neighborhood Medical Clinic, Dr. Tristan's Fit and Healthy Program, and Home Delivery Meals for Seniors by Rosa Plain Food. And more uh, closures of uh, roads in Imperial County. Orchard Road from 4th Street in Hopeville to Havens Road closed beginning the 1st of March through the 15th of April. A uh, detour will be uh, posted. The reason for the closure is Orchard Road improvements. Also, uh, Road uh, Pond Road from Blair to a half mile east of Blair Road at the, the end of the road. That is a closure, um, and it'll stay that way for a while. We'll be back with a look at the weather. Nice to explore your options to buying insurance, no matter what you're looking for. David H. West Insurance Services offers it all. And being an independent broker, we have many companies to choose from. We continue providing Medicare, life, and health plans, and now offer auto, home, and commercial insurance. David H. West Insurance Services can find the right insurance to fit your needs and budget. And best of all, a staff who cares about you. So don't hesitate to pick up the phone and call David H. West Insurance Services at 760-352-3411. That's 352-3411 for a free insurance review. That's 352-3411. Here's Carol Buckley with a weather update. According to the National Weather Service, high pressure building into the region will boost temperatures to slightly above normal values starting today and continuing through the weekend. A passing dry weather disturbance on Saturday will bring a return to breezy conditions, but clear to mostly clear skies will remain. Stronger high pressure will develop over the region for the first half of next week, with high temperatures likely climbing to near 80 degrees in the Imperial and Yuma Valleys. Dry conditions will prevail through early next week. 68, our high yesterday. 42 the low, sunny today with a high near 74, light wind. Mostly clear tonight with a low around 46, light wind becoming west-northwest about 5 miles an hour. Sunny with a high 80, south wind 5 to 10 miles an hour becoming northwest in the afternoon. Sunday will be sunny with a high near 75, north wind about 10 miles an hour, gusting as high as 20 miles an hour. 
44 degrees downtown, 38% relative humidity. Wind out of the southwest, 3 to 5 miles an hour. Air quality is good throughout the valley, moderate right at the border. Page 2 of the local news and the weather brought to you by David H. West Insurance Services. See David or Jose for health insurance plans and Medicare supplemental coverage. David H. West insurance services. Last year was crazy. My hours were cut. I was out of work for months. I, I need, need a, a job. job. At the Center for Employment Training, study for a career in construction or healthcare. Go to cetweb.edu. Financial aid is available to those who qualify. And we offer job placement assistance to graduates. All programs can be completed in under a year based on attendance. Go to ctweb.edu or call 6-0-592-0208 for CET. Work hard. Be strong. It's sports time brought to you by Pioneers Memorial Healthcare District, an affiliate of the Scripps Health Network, working together to provide you the best care. NBA basketball Raptors roll. They beat the Bucks 110-96. Nets over the Lakers 109-8. Heat uh, they top the Kings 118-110. The only games on NBA book. And uh, speaking of NBA, LeBron, what's his name? Oh, James, or is it James LeBron? And Brooklyn Nets forward Kevin Durant are the captains for next month's NBA All Star Game. I get a kick out of that. Why bother? <sighs> anyway, NFL, the uh, Philadelphia Eagles have agreed to trade quarterback Carson Wentz to the Indianapolis Colts for a 2021 third round draft pick. Conditional 2022 second round pick that could turn to a first rounder, according to league sources. Pioneers Memorial Healthcare District is open and ready to serve you and your family for all your health care needs. Let our team of dedicated physicians guide you on a journey to better health. Pioneers is a recognized leader in health care and has more than 10 health centers and clinics throughout the Imperial Valley. When the need arises, don't hesitate to come and see us. We have services and locations in Calexico and Broncos, our award-winning hospital, Pioneers Memorial. For more information on all the Pioneer services, visit pmhd.org today. And baseball pitchers and catchers are, uh, well, they're at spring training. Padres, well, they uh, they have uh, continued to make some moves. It's official in that uh, they have sent um, a couple of pitchers that uh, will help in the bullpen. And the Mets have agreed to two terms with Taiwan Walker on a two-year, $20 million deal. And according to Roberts, Kenley Jansen will be the closer for the Dodgers this year, at least now. Uh, that's it for Sports Time, brought to you by Pioneers Memorial Healthcare District. Log on to pmhd.org for more information about Pioneers Memorial Healthcare District. Thank you for choosing Imperial Printers Rocket Copy. In today's highly competitive business climate, your company's image is important. The printed materials your company conveys a major part of that image. Our graphic designers have the talent and expertise to create a lasting impression for your business. Imperial Printers Rocket Copy offers virtually any type of business solution to meet your needs. From business cards and stationery to computer forms, full color brochures and posters. Let our excellent service and attention to detail provide the best impression for you. Locally and operated, Imperial Printers Rocket Copy has locations near you at 430 West Main Street and 100 South 11th Central and 184 South Plaza in Brawley. Financial news and a brief look at the weather brought to you by Southwest Security, a locally owned security service protecting you and your property. Southwest Security offers live scan fingerprints to the public. All of the packaged foods, U.S.-based employees, will make at least $15 an hour within a few months, according to the company. The $15 an hour that is actually being discussed today in the Biden administration, I think we're very close from actually doing the same ourselves 
said Pier Luigi Sigismondi, president of Dole Packaged Foods. The move comes as farm and plant workers across the U.S. have remained at high risk during the pandemic, often working in tight quarters. Speaking of uh, COVID-19 and uh, the pandemic, information is so far just 51 people are known to have contracted COVID-19 more than once. But uh, medical experts are on high alert as the uh, virus continues to mutate. And uh, the uh, markets right now, well, the Dow Jones Industrial Average up 104 points at 31,618. The S&P 500 at uh, 3,926. That's up uh, $12.90. The NASDAQ at 92 points at 13,957. Gold up $6.90 an ounce. Oil is down 79 cents a barrel. Southwest Security Company is a locally owned security company protecting you or your business and now offering live scan fingerprinting to the public. Plus, they added postal with post office boxes you can access 24 hours a day, 365 days a year with shipping services too using DHL, UPS, and FedEx. They're conveniently located at the corner of Hyle and 4th Street in El Centro. And if you need something notarized, they can do that too. You can count on South Southwest Security and Southwest Postal for 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. We will have skies today with a high near 74 light wind. Mostly tight with a low around 46 light wind to be coming west northwest about 5 miles an hour. Saturday will be sunny with a higher 80 south wind 5 to 10 miles an hour becoming northwest tomorrow afternoon. 45 degrees and 10, 37 percent relative humidity. Wind out of the southwest at about five miles an hour. Air quality throughout the Imperial Valley right now is good. Moderate right order, slightly elevated PM 2.5. Financial news and the weather. Brought to you by Southwest Security. They now offer 20-hour-a-day post boxes. Southwest Postal at the corner of 4th and Hyle in El Centro. Hey, subscribe to our YouTube channel. It's free. What we've just done for the last 30 minutes on YouTube. KXO, El Centro, on AM 1230, KXO. This is CBS News on the Hour, your home for original reporting. I'm Steve Kathan. The attack at the U.S. Capitol. CBS's Jim Crisula says there's been some new fallout. CBS News has learned that six Capitol Police officers have been suspended without pay, and another 35 are under investigation for their roles in the January 6th riot at the U.S. Capitol. More plenary action is possible within the agency since there's an ongoing internal investigation. Food and water are hard to come by in much of Texas. Shoppers are finding store shelves empty. Just make the best of the situation like we always would, man. That's all we left with. The power situation's improved, but thousands still don't have electricity, and some have been hit with energy bills in the thousands of... FEMA sent generators to water plants and health facilities in Texas for all the storms. Acting Administrator Bob Fenton tells CBS This Morning. What has me most worried is uh, making sure that people stay warm. Texas has set up a number of warming stations where people could go. So if you're cold, uh, don't stay in your house. Go to one of the warming stations. Pfizer is studying the effect of the COVID vaccine on pregnant women. CBS's Cammie McCormick. This is one bad bug. Dr. Frank Shervanak says there's no reason pregnant women shouldn't be vaccinated to avoid the risks involved. The reality is that they're more susceptible to death, to admission to ICUs, to going into premature labor and having all complications of pregnancy. Even before data from the new clinical trials comes in, many doctors say the benefits of the vaccines are already clear. Today, the U.S. rejoined the Paris climate deal. John Kerry, the Biden administration's climate point man, tells CBS News the pullout by Donald Trump cost valuable time. The scientists told us three years ago we had 12 years of the worst consequences of climate crisis. We are now three years gone, so we have nine years left. The U.S. will resume climate aid 
to poorer nations. Newly released video relieves, or reveals more of what happened in the minutes before police in San Clemente, California, shot and killed a 42-year-old homeless man last September. It was a jaywalking dispute, and the attorney for Kurt Reinhold's family, John Taylor, held a lawsuit. They create the confrontation. They escalate the confrontation. They're the first person to put their hands on him, and they end up, you know, taking his life. Buckingham Palace Prince Harry and wife Meghan will not return to any royal duties. A year after the couple indicated that's what they wanted to do, Harry will give up honorary military titles. Wall Street right now, now the debt 131 points. This is CBS News. CBS News Radio is your home for breaking news. With our team of reporters around the country and the world, we give you the coverage you can trust. Why so serious? Build your drink? Uh, Quick, the quicker picker-upper. Bounty picks up spills and messes quicker. And each sheet is two times more absorbent, so you can use less than the leading value brand. So you can get back to the party. Bounty, the quicker picker-upper. You're ready to get back into yoga, so you order the essentials. A non-slip mat, yoga blocks to keep balance, and an exercise ball. And you use your Bank of America Cash Rewards credit card. Choosing to earn 3% cash back on online shopping and up to 5.25% as a preferred rewards member. Which most essential yoga gear? Noise-canceling headphones. Welcome. Take a deep breath. Breathe. Apply for yours at bankofamerica.com slash more rewarding. Copyright 2020 Bank of America Corporation. There's controversy over a new take on some old songs. And you're thinking we'll be fine, but not this time. It didn't take long for Twitter to explode with criticism. After the Recording Academy announced Taylor Swift's re-recorded albums, like four-time Grammy winner Fearless, will be eligible for awards again. Swift gained permission to retract the music after a battle with producer Scooter Braun, who bought the rights to her records from her former label for $300 million. The Academy says Taylor's re-recordings will not be eligible for songwriting awards. Deborah Rodriguez, CBS News. The biggest names in Latin music were honored at last night's Premio Lo Nuestro Awards on Univision. Bad Bunny won Artist of the Year, Album of the Year, and also took home Best Urban Artist. Steve Kafin, CBS News. Ready to create your own income with your own home-based business where there's no such thing as getting laid off? If a billionaire entrepreneur spent five years and $20 million searching for the next big trend, wouldn't you want to know what he found? If you're serious about making money from home without having to leave home, then write this down. www.goherenext.com. You decide your income. Get the facts now. Goherenext.com. Have you wanted to speak a new language but thought it would be too difficult? Then try Babbel. Babbel starts by teaching you words and phrases that gradually get more complex. Soon, you're practicing short conversations. So in 15 minutes a day, you'll be speaking a new language in a few weeks. Babbel is built around real life. It teaches you practical conversations that you will actually use. Babbel, language for life. Celebrating 10 million subscriptions sold. Now try Babbel for free. Just text TRY to 64000 to start learning a new language today. That R Y to 64000. And now, more of the best oldies on the radio. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for Carol Buckley. Things he says and like like you can connect to them. AM 1230 KXO. AM 1230. 